Good evening and welcome to TL Physics and today I'm going to talk about damping. Now damping is the phenomena about why an oscillation comes to a stop. What there is, is instead of where resonance happening, is that you're adding force to create a greater oscillation. Damping is when forces diminish, you know, they take energy from the system. Energy uh, forces uh, like friction, etc. So damping, okay, damping is when a force removes energy from an oscillating system. So I've got here, I've got a uh, normal oscillation, and this is if damping never happened. I have the same amplitude, it's going to carry on forever. And there are three ways that damping can occur. There's heavy, there's light, and there's critical. I'm going to start with light damping. And light damping is something where the oscillation decreases over time. So you can see here, I've got my maximum and then it's decreasing. So this here is light damping, where amplitude decreases over time. So this is just your natural occurrence. This will eventually decrease over time due to friction in the air or drag. Now, there are two other types of damping. These are called heavy and critical. Now, heavy damping is when the resistive forces are so strong that it doesn't allow an oscillation at all. So what actually happens is that I get a change in oscillation here, but so it starts with that, but what happens is that over time it gradually goes to zero and it will look more like a curve to be honest. It will go, it will look more like a curve here. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to change this graph slightly and I'm going to do the cos graph that everyone sort of knows and loves here. So this is the initial thing here and it takes time to uh, go back to zero. So this is heavy damping. And this is the kind of damping which is used for something, for normally a safety measure, to be honest. So a heavy damping is when it doesn't oscillate. But goes slowly to equilibrium over time. And so we use these for safety measures. So a door, for example, a door is heavily damped. And this is because what we're trying to do is, is a safety measure. We do not want a door to slam on your fingers and hurt them. So the doors that are the slow closing doors, they're heavily damped. There's springs inside that are taking away the kinetic energy and slowing it down over time. If there was no door frame or if there was no, um, just the hinges there, there's no door frame, it, when you open the door and you let it go, it will just oscillate. And it would lightly damp over time. But that's not good. I'm still going to get hit in the face. So we heavily damp it. Okay. Now the last one is critical damping. And critical damping is once you've changed it, it immediately tends to zero. So critical damping is once displaced, will go back to the equilibrium point. Okay? So these are things that once you start them in motion, they don't oscillate and they very quickly go back to original thing, original point. Bike, uh, bike suspension, suspension in general. You do not want your car when you go over a speed bump to sit there going like, oh, some of you might, but you don't want to start oscillating like this. What you want to do is if it goes down, 
because it's gone over a speed bump or into a pothole. You want it to go back to its original position almost instantaneously. You do not want to start oscillating around that spring because you've changed the extension of the spring. So your suspension systems are critically damped, which means that after they have changed position, they will go back to the equilibrium almost immediately. Okay. So a lightly damped system is the traditional oscillation that decreases in amplitude over time. A heavy damp system is one that will very slowly go to zero. And a critically damp system is one that will go to zero almost immediately after being displaced. So suspension, safety doors, and just normal oscillation. In an exam, you may be asked to give an example of a uh, oscillation, you may be asked to draw this graph. You may be asked to identify is this light critical or heavy damping or give an example of those situations. And that is damping. Thank <laughs> you.